Lego world. <laughs> hey guys, how's everybody doing? So welcome to Lego World, just like he said. Um, so I don't know if you guys know this, but most of my channel is was built on the fact that um, I was the first person to upload Lego Marvel Avengers for Vita gameplay and Lego games have a special place in my heart so when I heard that this game was coming out I definitely jumped on it um, but yeah I haven't played this yet um, I played well that's, that's, that's a lie I played like the first 15 20 minutes of it um, just the tutorial part and that's what this video is going to be it's going to be the first three worlds but I deleted my save game and I'm going to do it again just for you guys so let's go ahead and do it So if you guys end up liking this video and you want to see more videos from this game, let me know, leave it a like, and uh, let me know in the comments, and I'll definitely do that for you guys. So like I said, the first three worlds are tutorial type levels. And then um, after that, the game opens up, and then you can go to like all the different random worlds. And it's really cool because um, it's like basically every time I play the game, it's gonna be a completely different world. So here's where you customize your character. Uh, I'm not really gonna do that right now. You can you can do that at a later time. So right now I'm just going to pick whoever is there, so we can get into the game really quick. The game is much prettier than I thought it was gonna be. I am playing it on a PlayStation 4 Pro, and I have noticed the frame rate is not the best uh, in certain spots. Pirate Playground. All right, so this is Pirate first Playground, the first Lego world. tutorial level. So much to discover, but your rocket took a beating. A few gold bricks should fix it right up. A wonderful world of possibilities, and somewhere, a way to fix your rocket. Okay, so you can pretty much climb anything. Look. A meteorite. You'd better go and check out the crash site. So just take a look at this world. It looks really good. I don't know why it keeps telling me to press any button on player 2 controller. There isn't even one plugged in. Okay. The discovery tool. Use the powerful discovery tool to scan. Okay, so basically the discovery tool is what you use to discover things. So when you pick the discovery tool, let's say for example, I want to discover this. Or this. Objects. So now it ends up in my uh, inventory here and I can build it wherever I want later in the game. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some bricks. So this first brick is over here and I need three bricks to unlock my spaceship. Alright, so open this up. I gotta discover the chickens and pigs, which are not here. <laughs> Whoops. Come here. Come here. Gotcha. 
All right, now I just need Creatures. a chicken. There's the chicken. I hear it. There you are. Okay. How many do I need? Okay. Now I need chicken. Four. One, two, three, four. And I got my first gold brick. Oh, no, I don't. I thought I put down three. There. So right now, a bunch of trophies would be popping up. <laughs> this the game literally throws trophies at you the first to hour. A master builder. But you'll need two more gold bricks to fix your rocket. Look at the way the texture is on the uh, on the bricks. There's so much attention to the would be um, because it's just a bunch of Lego bricks, but they did a really good job. Alright, so this guy wants a pirate throne. I can't remember where it is. I'm pretty sure... Uh, uh, where is it? I think it's over here. Oh, well, before I do that, let's go do this other brick here. Conveniently, the thing that she needs is inside the treasure chest. Brick builds. Okay. So now I can just put this wherever, and then I get the brick. All right, let's go get that last one, which is uh, copying the throne. There it is. Two out of three. Just one more, and you can lift off to another world. Again, every world is random. Not these first three worlds, they don't seem to be random, but uh, every other world after them are. Alright, so now I need to build him a throne. I will build it right there. Alright. Discoverer Builder. Okay. Three gold bricks. That so... That's exactly what your rocket needs. Congratulations. Okay, I think it's over there. Yeah, there it is. Here, have some bricks. The galaxy map shows you the worlds you have been to, the world you're on, and the worlds you're yet to explore. Collect more gold bricks and you'll be able to travel farther afield 
to bigger worlds with more biomes and a huge variety of new discoveries. Okay, second world, which is a prehistoric world, and to be honest, I'm a little disappointed because there's no dinosaurs anywhere. Um, just a bunch of cavemen. <laughs> prehistoric peril. Okay. So ah, I believe there's the four bricks in. on this oh. one. My mistake. It's one of those meteorites again. Cool. So this tool basically lets me terraform the uh, the land. The landscape tool. The landscape tool gives you the power to reshape. Okay. So the first brick is over here. The landscape tool gives you many choices. Now, choose how to rescue this poor fellow. Unlocked. Flatten. So, um... See, what should I do here? That's not what I wanted to do. Why is that wall there? Come on, buddy. Hmm. I don't know why, but sometimes they don't move unless you, like, flatten something around them. He's still not moving. Come on, buddy. has been flattened it's perfect for building on be careful though because the landscape tool can flatten entire buildings if you're not careful <laughs> cave people they do tend to get themselves stuck now if you had a tool that could remove terrain you could help easy peasy So normally, this would be a lot more involving, you know, but since I've already done it, I'm kind of breezing through it so I can get past the tutorial for you guys. Please dig the landscape responsibly. But if you guys are playing for the first time, this is a lot more fun to discover all of this stuff. 
Okay, so... I need another brick. There we go. There must be a way to bridge this lava. You could use the landscape tool to place some bricks unlocked. Add and remove. There we go. Oh. Gotta make it. Last brick. You could build an island out at sea, or a stairway to the clouds. Your tools, your decision. You can choose either to raise or lower to raise. Whichever you go for really depends on the situation. Unlocked. Raise and lower. Select a shape. There. Did I do it? Oh no, I didn't do it. <laughs> Whoops. That wasn't supposed to happen. Now I gotta figure out how to get her out of there. Can't she just friggin' climb it? Please dig the landscape responsibly. That volcano looks dangerous. You might want to take this opportunity to get out of here. I'm going. So we're going to the last world now, which is Candyland, pretty much. Candyland is probably my favorite one. So yeah, like I said, this one's probably my favorite one. It just looks really cool. Candy construction capers. 
What a delicious looking world. Ice creams, cakes, and gingerbread houses. Lovely. The copy tool is pretty self-explanatory. Just copies models and stuff. The copy tool. The copy tool makes it easy to take copies of things you find. Okay, onto the first brick. Actually, you know what? I'm wondering. Maybe I should make this my my uh, thumbnail. Looks really nice and colorful. All right, first brick. Whoops. Mr. Gingerbread wants another house. House is standing all sorry sight. There should be at least one more to keep it company. You can adjust the finer details of your model here. Add bricks, remove bricks, or just leave it as it is. If you're happy with it, name it, frame it, save it for later. Now, don't forget, the discovery tool can place anything from your collection, including any models that you've saved. Okay, let's uh, let's place it right here. Woo! Boom. Copying isn't cheating. It's just saving time. So now, the first time I did this, I ended up building the entire wall, but apparently you don't need to do that. Just FYI. The build tool. This is the build tool. Giving excellent. <laughs> you sound like Mr. Burns. Building one brick at a time. The old-fashioned way. All right. Now you can make exactly what you want to in every detail. Whoops. Ah. I screwed up. Mm-hmm. What the hell did I do? Good enough. Okay. Oh, she needs a little bit more. There we go. Okay, so I forget Great. where the other brick You'll is. You'll collect more and more different kinds of bricks as you explore new Lego worlds. Oh yeah, it's right here. The paint tool. Select the paint tool to change the color of any. It's a shame when something looks that plain. It really could do with a splash of color. So again, you don't have to paint the entire house. 
she just wants a little bit. There, that should be good enough. All right. Another challenge overcome, and a just reward. Ten gold bricks. This will power up the rocket and give it enough energy to reach an unlimited number of new worlds. Get back to the rocket, if you're ready for adventure. All right, guys, so that was pretty much the... Um, I'm going to give you guys a quick little look at the infinite worlds, and then I'm going to... Uh, finish the video and then in the next video I'll uh, showcase some of the random worlds that I've seen okay so I've unlocked small worlds and then you got like all these other worlds that I have never even seen yet so let's unlock small random worlds and basically what you want to do is you just click find a random world and then it just generates on the fly random worlds that you can go to. So let's just generate one really quick. Let's do, um, I don't know. Let's uh, let's do a nice forest level. Yeah, this one's cool. Okay, so this is again. This is a completely random world. Nobody will ever see this on any other YouTube video, um, which is pretty cool. I like that. I mean, granted, they look similar, but they're not exactly the same. Kind of like No Man's Sky, but better. Okay. All right, so this Mary level Meadows. has been completely generated on the fly, and everything in it is populated Free build. randomly. Free build mode gives you access to all of the tools in one useful bar. Great for advanced players. You can switch between any tool without having to open the game wheel. Free build provides you with some additional options and can help with more accurate placement. And yeah, um, I haven't seen this uh, this world yet either. Um, so again, this is completely fresh to me. Um, there's yellow bricks to find on here. Uh, just pretty much a new game every time you play. It's pretty friggin' awesome. And I really can't wait to uh, sink my teeth into it. So I'm gonna end the video here. Um, in the next video, I'll search around this world a little bit and then look at some other worlds and we'll go from there. If you wanna make this a whole series, leave it a like and let me know if you guys wanna see more. Um, otherwise, I'll just enjoy it on my own time. That's not a problem with me. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see it, let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.